days ago, we officially defeated the worst president in the history of our country, crooked Joe Biden. He quit because he was losing so badly in the polls. He was down in every single poll and down by a lot, so he quit. We have a new victim to defeat, Lion Kamala Harris. Lion, L-Y-I-N apostrophe. The most incompetent and far left vice president in American history. By the way, they did a poll. She was rated the worst vice president in history. I've never seen that poll before, but that's the poll. For three and a half years, Lion Kamala Harris has been the ultra-liberal driving force behind every single Biden catastrophe. She is a radical left lunatic who will destroy our country. When you're dealing with these people, they're very dangerous people. When you're dealing with them, you can't be too nice. You really can't be. So if you don't mind, I'm not going to be nice. Is that OK? Three days ago, we officially defeated the worst president in the history of our country, crooked Joe Biden. He quit because he was losing so badly in the polls. He was down in every single poll and down by a lot, so he quit. But really, what happened was the leaders of the Democrat Party, in a very undemocratic move, the bosses, they said, either you get out or we're going to throw you out using the 25th Amendment. That's what happened. You know that. So what? Well, you know that. That's what happens. That's what happens. These are nasty people, the Democrats. So we better beat them or we're not going to have a country left. You're not going to have a country left. So now we have a new victim to defeat. Lion Kamala Harris. Lion. L-Y-I-N apostrophe. The most incompetent and far left vice president in American history. By the way, they did a poll. She was rated the worst vice president in history. I've never seen that poll before, but that's the poll. Together, we will win North Carolina in an epic landslide. We're way ahead in the poll. And we will take back that beautiful White House, and we will very simply make America great again. For three and a half years, Lion Kamala Harris has been the ultra-liberal driving force behind every single Biden catastrophe. She is a radical left lunatic who will destroy our country. If she ever gets the chance to get into office, we're not going to let that happen. You know, I was supposed to be nice. They say something happened to me when I got shot. I became nice. And when you're dealing with these people, they're very dangerous people. When you're dealing with them, you can't be too nice. You really can't be. So if you don't mind, I'm not going to be nice. Is that OK? I'm not gonna. They want me to be nice. Kamala Harris is the most liberal elected politician in American history. Did you know that? She's an ultra-liberal politician. She's absolutely terrible. She's, as you know, more liberal than Bernie Sanders. Can you believe it? She's rated far more liberal than Bernie Sanders. And she's now trying to get rid of her record, but she can't. She's going out and saying things that she doesn't believe in if she ever got in, she destroyed this country so fast. So she was the border czar, but she never went to the border, right? She, she never, she was appointed by this horrible president, this horrible guy. How this guy got to be president in his basement. He stayed in his basement. And we did a lot better the second time than we did the first. How this guy got to be president, what they've done to this country in three and a half years, and we're going to turn it around. But what they've done to our country is unthinkable. As borders are, Kamala threw open our borders and allowed 20 million illegal aliens to stampede into our country from all over the world. 
As Vice President, she cast the tie-breaking votes that created the worst inflation in a half a century, decimating middle-class families and hurting very badly, as you know, all people in North Carolina. And by the way, Laura says hello. Laura, do we love Laura? How good is Laura? She is terrific. She has done a, a tremendous job. You know, I'm saying it now because if I forget it later on, they'll say he's cognitively challenged. I don't want to be cognitively, no, but I want to thank her because she's unbelievable. She loves it. I'll introduce Michael in a couple of minutes, but I want to remember to introduce Lara. She's been a fantastic daughter-in-law and wife to Eric. And she happened to name her one beautiful daughter, you know what? Carolina. Carolina. I said, which one? Which Carolina? She said, well, North, of course. <laughs> no. Let's call them both. <laughs> Do you mind if I call them both? They've both been great, frankly. And when Kamala Harris was sent to Europe to deter Russia, what a joke that was, from attacking Ukraine, how did that work out? Russia answered by launching the invasion just five days after she left. Putin laughed at her like she was nothing. She is nothing. She's going to be, she's so bad for us. Everything Kamala touches turns into a total disaster. She's destroyed San Francisco with her policies. Check out San Francisco. 20 years ago, it was the greatest city in our country. Today, it's not a livable city. She'll destroy our country if she's elected, so we won't let her be elected. We can't let that happen. होसा सुधिगला नोटिफिकेशन गागी बेल आइकॉन क्लिक मारे लेटेस्ट अपडेट्स गागी www.vistaranews.com वेबसाइट के विजिट मारे आंगे ये ले जगतीना सुधी तेलियलू विस्तारा न्यूज़ कनाडा ऐप डाउनलोड मारे